Well, I'm sure it won't surprise you that food and the big game go hand in hand. It's estimated that 1.3 billion chicken wings will be consumed during the event. Chicken wings are just one popular appetizer that you'll see at the table during this weekend's watch parties. All this week, we're going to feature fun snacks you can bring to your big game party. And today, I'm showing you and Ann one of my favorite, one of my personal favorites. Actually, that's kind of not true because Ann brought this to us. So we learned about this, uh, this dish uh, just a few weeks ago, actually, we made we it for a, uh, we made it for a New Year's Eve party. New Year's Eve party, but Ann right. found it online somewhere, and we thought it would be a great thing to try. And so we're going to make it for you here today. And actually, I did make these last night by myself, he so did. I can do this by myself. I let him, but I they're let him called they're called what again? Uh, tater tot bacon bombs. Tater tot bacon bombs, and it's actually quite simple. And really, it's bacon, it's tater tots, a little cheese. And then we're going to add some uh, brown sugar into it. So it's a pretty mm -hmm. cool deal. We're going to so. dredge it in brown sugar. Yeah. So anyway, so let's get the parchment. Okay. Is that what you call this? This is parchment paper. Parchment Jay. paper. This is good. And this lines your this lines your cooking sheet. You can use this, or you can use um, one of those mats if you have it. And uh, I have this fun little parchment yeah, paper. Yeah, I, I, I hadn't seen that at home Gary until had. last night. So that's and the first cool. time, hey, just warning you, first time we made this, I was in a super hurry and. Um, and I put wax paper down. I grabbed the wax paper up by accident. Yeah, so that, so was no that good. went into the oven, and yeah. soon things were smoking good. So this is pretty simple. So we took the tater paper. tots. We took the tater tots, and we had them frozen. And so that actually, I kind of mm -hmm. like the way that they turned out, even though it's tough to put the toothpicks in them. Mm -hmm. But anyway, take your tater tots, and you take a, a, a package of bacon, and cut that bacon in half. Now you could do it in thirds. But I did it in half last night just because I like bacon, and the more bacon, the better. <laughs> and then you've got some cheddar cheese. So we just took slices of cheddar cheese, and I just pinched them in half or made them in little slices like this because we're going to wrap the uh, tater tots in those. And then we're going we're gonna, to uh, uh, drizzle uh, brown sugar at the end over you the top dredge of it. Dredge it. Thank you for that word. So and anyway. You need, and you need uh, little... Um, toothpicks. toothpicks as toothpicks. well. You'll see to how. Kind of secure yes, them. So let's get some toothpicks out. You want to do that while I start I'll getting. I'll do the um, toothpicks. While I get some of this. So I take the tater tot, put my little cheese around it here, grab my slice of bacon, and. Uh, bacon. See, I mean, this, make is, this is a lot. Better? This is yes. a lot of bacon, and but boy, I mean, you can do it any way you want. And we tried the thick sliced bacon. Yeah, that didn't work. But it was really a little bit too cumbersome, so we went with a thinner sliced bacon, and just the regular ones, and cutting them in half. Worked so, best for so us. I, I wrapped the tot, and then uh, last. Oh God, this is kind of. I should have put some fresh. Here we go, and then just it's drizzle. It's a little cold. Yeah, and put the um, brown sugar over the top of them, mm -hmm. and then uh, pinch it with a uh, toothpick. Boom. It, it's relatively simple, but since we had the big bacon to begin with, remember it was like a it was like an oil slick when it we did it. We were just slick. like the biggest and mess. Like, oh, we had thick bacon, bacon be really good grease on all over ourselves when we were making See, this. See, this the first this time. slice of bacon is a little bit less than the other one, so it doesn't wrap around twice. But um, but we can get it to to stick pretty good on there. Right. And then. So uh, is bacon your favorite food, Gary? I do like bacon. Who doesn't like so bacon? Sorry. You know, I had a coworker. Co-worker, he had a shrine to bake, and his entire office was a shrine to bacon. Shout out Scott Osman. So <laughs> shrine to bacon. bacon, bacon was his entire, his entire life. And, well, and, and, it, and as you can see, you start messing with that brown sugar. It is messy. I mean, it is is really messy. Okay, so. Okay, so our traditions watching yeah, the Super so. Bowl. So sometimes we go um, to friends' homes. Yeah, we've done and that. And we've in had years past. some people over at our home for. For Super Bowl as well, but most most of the time I'm like I'm at the point where I just I don't. Gary wants I solitude. I, but even there, I don't care anymore. I mean, if we got, I'm not. I'm just so bummed out yet that the He's Vikings so aren't <laughs> playing this weekend that I'm just. The like, morning hasn't quite subsided. I just don't care. I just, I just don't care, and uh, and so I just will watch the game and we'll. Well, you know, I know when the kids were home and we, you know, we had the family and stuff. I mean, sometimes we'd have just the family and we'd make something special and, and yeah, do whatever. Yeah, we, we did wings and we did, you know, special drinks and wings. And right. And oh, so we have another one we really like that's uh, um, ham, uh, Hawaiian, Hawaiian ham and Swiss cheese sliders. 
that are And really don't confuse really people good. here. We're sorry, trying to sorry. focus on this one, and you're like bringing up another one. I know. Maybe that's for later this yeah. week. So anyway, you, just, get the, you get the gist of what I'm doing here. I'm just teasing. So now we, okay, so let's show the recipe of what, because this is messy. Would you mind getting me a, a wrap? Okay, we, we brought so the wet wipes. So here's the recipe on it. There you so go. So it says two cups of frozen tater tots, a cup of cheddar, sharp cheddar cheese. We did, we did the cheddar, um, the bacon, brown sugar, and then you can top it off with some chopped parsley leaves or whatever you wanted mm -hmm. to do it with. But really, you could, you could, you know, I mean, you don't need to do it by the, I mean, last night I just said, oh, how many tots am I going to make? And I probably used a half a pound of bacon. Yeah. And um, last, last time we did it, you wanna make. for a decent crowd, we probably had 15 people and yep. we made like 60 of them. And we, um, they were gone. Yeah, they're really quick. Like that. So let's but, let's but allow time for assembling. That's a real yeah. It trick. takes a long time, and then and then yeah. when you cook them, you want to put preheat your oven to 400, and then uh, you put them in the oven, and at, at uh, about 10, 12 minutes, pull them out and flip them. And that was something that we did not do the first time we made it. So flip the bombs right. and then put them on another 10, 12 minutes, mm -hmm. and then this is the end result. So I mean, look how good these look. I mean, these are. This, they smell amazing. They and just we, didn't, we didn't put parsley on these because we didn't have any last night, but and they've been sitting in the fridge. Yeah, so you can do parsley or you could probably do chive or even dried parsley or something to make it green and a little colorful if you want yeah. to do it. I mean, I like cilantro too, but I'm going to eat when I haven't had a cold one ever. So. They're cold, but they still smell great. Our whole house smelled really great yeah. this morning. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Kayla, you want one? Sure, I have one. No, I shouldn't have done that. That was good. Shoot. So anyway, so there's our little tater tot bombs. Bacon bombs, thank you. So anyway. Tater tot so bacon bombs. So yeah, hopefully, easy to make, uh, but takes a lot of time. 100% healthy, zero calories. Right, exactly. But give yourself some time in assembling, and a couple people really makes, makes it work easy. So, But mm -hmm. yeah, you can make them as, as however you want. But And get the big tater tots, not the minis. Yeah, get the so big anyway. ones and get the thinner bacon. Yeah. So anyway, there's my, there's my deal this week. So anyway, that's it. Good stuff. Thanks for helping me on that. Nice job. Don't go away. We're going to show you some timeless design options to update your home.